do you think it's possible that they just arrested all these people who aren't even really committing crimes just to kind of get them to take these small pleas so that way they could use that as evidence against Young Thug? Yeah. Yeah, I just told you, the limo, the, the guy that was just giving you a ride, just doing the, giving you a ride, that knew what was going on, you think he want to look at the same time as the guys that's doing the actual crimes? Yo, it's all a game, um, Cam. It's a game with these, with these boys' lives. It's all a game. They know who role and what role everybody play. They know who, you know, who the weakest, who the strongest, who got children on the way, who mother is, need them on the street. Man, we're we not dealing with the same, we're not dealing with state, and this is what I be trying to tell these young boys now, man. You know, federal is so much different, man. You know what I'm saying? It's so much different. It's, it's just not worth it, bro. It's just not worth it. Yeah. Man. You know, and, and I just want, that's what Marcy Made is about. You know what I'm saying? It ain't about the double cross and all of that, that Jay and them played me and all of this. It's really about, you see what this shit does to you, your, your friendships and your family and what it do? You know what I'm saying? Is it really worth it? Nah, man, because they playing for keeps. <laughs> these, these new young uh, states attorneys and shit, they playing for keeps. These dudes looking for the be, they looking to make names. You got 24 and 25 people on indictments. Come on, man. You know, just, that, shit is, that shit is pathetic, yo. They, they can't find no other way to put them away fast enough and long enough than this right here. This was just like the old crack laws, but now this is different. You know, once we figured out how to get money and still keep the, you know, and still want to be street, they know what's going on. So, you know, my, you know, that young gunner, man, that's going to keep happening time and time again, long as these guys want to commit these type of acts. I seen you kind of touch base on the possibility of him beating his state case and the feds could still pick it up. Can you kind of talk about that a little bit? Because the state really, you know, they make a lot of mistakes. There's a lot of loopholes in there in their, when they do shit. You get what I'm saying? It's not really solid. You know what I'm saying? But that's the difference between state and federal. The, the, the federal get to pick and choose what cases that they would like to do. And most of the time, they're going to pick a winner. You know what I'm saying? That's the difference between them two, period. The, the feds is not going to waste any time and money on someone without them, without them being correct. That's just very rare. That's why their conviction rate is so high. Now, the state is something different. It's just be a lot of loopholes that they, they can get through. And sometimes they want to take double money. It's like once you finish paying for your state case, paying the lawyer, it's a game. Once you finish paying the lawyers for the state, the case that you beat, you don't gave up a few hundred thousand here or a couple of million here, right? And then as soon as you, th you know, they, they drop it, the feds pick it up, it's some more money. Now you need a federal lawyer. It's the, the pay rate, the pay rate is, you know, Google that. Google the pay rate from a state lawyer to a federal lawyer and see what those numbers look like. You know, you don't went from straight from high school to the, to the pros with that one. You know what I'm saying? So then now you got to spend money on that and this and that and all that and the third. It's just a game with that, man. You know what I'm saying? So that's the difference. You, you just, you know, federal level is not going to mess up. There ain't going to be no loopholes and mistakes in that case. I seen you touch base about how people can figure out like who the confidential informants are. Can you kind of like let people know a little bit about that? Yeah. I mean, you got a discovery, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Your lawyer should be able to give you a discovery of what they got. Trust me, this is what the feds going to do, bro. And this is why their conviction, conviction rate is so high. 
they're going to give you and show you what they have. It ain't no, you know, game. They're going to show you the surveillance. They're going to look at you and say, this, you know, your lawyer going to be going, this is you, right? This is you, and you're going to hear yourself on wiretaps, and they're going to show you what they have. So, you know, you will know how to handle the situation when they ask you whether you're going to, you know, tell or you're not, because you're going to, we're not going to waste time. So that's the difference right there. They're going to show you. It's a discovery that they're going to show you. You should be able to figure it out. Who, when you read it and you say, yo, I met Blanco at the store, and it's a question mark there. I met Blank at the store, and I bought two bricks. And you like, damn, I only met one person there and shit. So you start to see through the loopholes and shit of who's telling and shit. You know what I mean? So... You know, everybody gonna know who's who when it's all said and done. What's up? This is Cam Capone. We got more content like this coming soon. So hit that like button, subscribe, and stay locked in to Cam Capone News.